support you've shown over the years. You're not afraid to jump into a few different cars and have a crack. How did this HQ deal come about this weekend? Uh, yeah, the HQ came about. We had the car lying around at work for a few years and uh, the boys decided about three weeks ago to get together and we come here and do this race. So, um, yeah, that's how it came about. Got a few mates together, put a bit of sponsorship on it and uh, rolled her on down to Bathurst. And you've had to have a bit of help from the HQ community to keep it on the track today. Yeah, well, we uh, we popped the motor about you know first couple of laps in the first session, and uh, you know it was like lifeline. There, everyone come around and gave us an engine and distributor and lent us tools and got the car going again. But um, really, Robbo went out there and uh, got a few laps, so she's she's going okay. I guess looking to the rest of the weekend, any laps you can do around here must be good fun. Yes, uh, look, the HQ is really, really good fun around here. Um, the last time I drove it was in 2008. We actually actually won the race. I was driving Bobby McGee's car, so uh, it's one of the best things I've ever done. All the guys are awesome to race against. Um, they're really hardcore racers and have a good time while they're doing it. So uh, a couple of the V8 supercar guys could learn some lessons off them. Your involvement in V8 supercars has changed a little bit for this year. Do we still expect to see you in the endurance races? Yeah, yeah, I'll be in the Enduros, um, so I'm going to you know, help Lucas Dumbrell out with the strategy and in the pit uh, throughout the races and then uh, you know, drive for him in the, in the Enduros, so yeah, still keep my eye on there and uh, after how we finished last year, it'll be good to come back and, and uh, get a finish. You've had some close calls to wins up here before with the Super Tour getting DSQ'd and you won the 500k Super Tour race. Is it frustrating that you're not counted as a Bathurst winner in most people's eyes? Yeah, it, uh, it eats me up every day. <laughs> so, um, yeah, the chances of that happening now are pretty slim, so you just got to accept it. And uh, you know, it doesn't doesn't really matter that much, but it really would be nice to have your name on that trophy for sure.